If one in 10 men had a disorder that affected all aspects of their health, including their literal organs, their metabolic health, their future fertility, and their mental health, I guarantee you that there will be plenty of funding to figure that disease out, but not when it comes to the one in 10 women who have PCOS. Yet this disease, which causes a five times higher rate of having uterine cancer, gets no funding. And this disorder is often overlooked when it comes to the metabolic health of these patients, especially when it comes to insurance covering even the current options that we have, like GLP-1s. And almost all those patients are overlooked when it comes to their mental health because having this order that makes you feel terrible is not really worth looking into apparently and in fact so few people are actually funding this and looking into this disease that is currently called an orphan disease which is terrible let me just say that as a patient who has pcos and a doctor who takes care of a lot of patients with pcos this is incredibly frustrating because patients want answers they want to understand why do i have this disorder what management options do i have and is anyone looking past management to make this go away but imagine if one in ten men had this disorder